What's this then? All of a sudden it got so dark. But what is that? Consider this a warning to all Pokemon in this world. I'm Eveltal. I'm the one true destroyer. I'm an end to Pokemon. What if this is in 3D? Hang on, let me check that. Oh, that looks weird in 3D. Okay, let's go back to 2D. There we go. Destroyer? An end to Pokemon? Allow me to demonstrate. Now I shall send all Pokemon in this world to the void. I shall snatch away the energy of all Pokemon. What? 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 It is already too late for you to possibly escape. No matter where you are in the world. No matter how far you run. I shall hunt you down. You will become nothing. Prepare yourselves for the coming of my wrath. Tremble before the great terror that I shall unleash. Feel the unending despair that I shall bring to the world. See, Arceus is just there chilling. I feel like Arceus would easily be able to destroy a Veltal. Even if Zekrom and Reshiram like, teamed up or Kyogre. Like, I just feel like Veltal is just really not that great. Like, don't get me wrong, I love a Veltal, but seems really OP in this game. And so, Veltal and Nuzli's attacks turned Pokemon to stone began. Many Pokemon in places all around the world were turned into stone. A few days later, here on the summit of Revelation Mountain. It really is all dried up. They sucked out all the luminous water. Well, well, well. To think that Hayden was the key to it all. From the first mention of the human world, should have pondered it more deeply. How foolish I was. There's nothing to be done about it. We had no information to go on. Maybe we were a little late. We had to consider everything we learned about Hayden to, be, to progress. Since we lost contact with the team that went to the prehistoric ruins too, we would assume they were also turned to stone. What should we do, Amphros? We may be the last members of the Expedition Society. Welcome back, Esper. How are things in the village? Not good. Everyone was turned into stone. I'm the only one left. I don't get it. What do we do now? I'm certainly at a loss here. It's okay. We'll figure something out. Really? We learned a lot, thanks to your contacting us with your telepathy. Including the events that took place here. Of course, there is still much we do not understand. And so our expeditions must continue. Our confrontation with Eveltal will have to wait until we have learned more. It's okay. We will save them. Everyone in Serene Village. Hayden, Sparky, and the others too. Esper? Can I count on you to help us out? Uh, help us out? I've got no place else to go. You're gonna save everyone, Mr. Amphros. I believe in you. Please let me help you. Thanks, Esper. This may not be the best situation right now, but we'll make a comeback somehow. We we'll have to wait for our chance. Let's not let it slip away when it comes. I forgot Esper uh, ran after us. I'm still really annoyed, Mr. Nuzla, Mr. Nuzleaf portrayed us. Like, ah. Uh, Sucks, man. I really liked him. I say I'm really something like Nuzleafs now, but nope. When and betrayed us, and he's actually a bad guy. Did not see that coming. Chapter seventeen: The Void Lands. Where am I, Sparky? Oh, hate him. Huh? Why? Whoa, look at that, hate him. What is this place? This is crazy scary. Looks pretty cool, though. Uh, this place looks far too frightening. How in the world do we end up in a place like this? Oh, yeah, that reminds me. Nuzleaf turned us a stone, right? But if that's the case, what is this place? Could it be. That is the world you live in after being turned to stone? I don't know, but if it is, where are Archon and the others? Raikou, Suicune, or even Crocodile? I was shocked to find that Mr. Nuzleaf was behind those turn-in-the-stone incidents. 
Turns out he was a bad guy. Can never forgive him for tricking you like that, Hayden. I don't know, man, I can't forgive him either. Ah, oh, so annoyed. Why would Mr. Nuzleaf, I mean, why would Nuzleaf want to turn Pokemon to stone? Ah, it's just too much to take. My head is spinning. And another thing, this place looks crazy scary. I feel totally helpless. Seriously, what are we gonna do? Uh, there are way too many things we don't understand going on here. I don't think we're going to learn anything standing around here though. Right now we need to focus. Find a way out of here. Sparky? Yeah? I know. Can't give up now, right? If we don't have hope, don't have anything. Can't lose hope? No, we can't. Let's go uh, deposit some money and stuff. I don't want to end up like in a situation where I can't do anything again. That was awful. Um, draw some items. So we've got quite a, a lot of things in here, so I'm going to bring... Uh, Ooh, Warp's Pokemon makes it petrophatic? One of them at least. Actually, I'll get a couple of these. Could come in handy. Is there anything, anything else? Okay, we're good. Alright, let's leave this place and... Path is blocked to go this way. See, part of me thinks... There's a greater evil than a Veltal. Like, I know from the film, Veltal can, um... Turn Pokemon to stone. I can't help but think... Something's given him more power because it's about like Arceus was there, and I don't know. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love Eveltar, he was great in my uh, Sinking Sapphire and Nuzlocke. God, he, he was amazing. What, got him episode 2, lived till like second to last episode? It was great. Anyway, I, I just feel like you know, Arceus wouldn't be scared or. Wait, it's just a Electro sleep in there. Yeah, can I leave him alone? I feel like Zekrom and Reshiram wouldn't be scared of Veltal and Claydol. Let's run away from you. I've learned not to attack sleeping Pokemon because they are way too strong sometimes. Oh god, I've got a Midnight Trick there. Can I not go for a Lion's Attack? No space. Okay, I can't. Let's go for a Flame Burst. Just if you missed last episode, the last, well, going up Revelation Mountain was atrocious. Like, I didn't say this last episode, but I was, like, literally so close to, uh, quitting the series because I could not do Revelation Mountain. I spent an hour trying to get through there. Like, there's one point where, literally, I started floor one, I walked one step, and then, uh, basically a stupid knocked out off screen. I couldn't even see it. I had no idea it was there. I walked one step. Oh, God. You went for an air cutter. Killed me in one hit, it was a critical hit. I had to redo the dungeon after walking one step. And I was like, oh, I was so close to just quitting. So close to quitting, but I'm glad I didn't because the story for this is super good. Let's get that elixir, there we go. Need to put them uh, stones on the looplet as well. Gotta say, this game is really hard though. Like, I haven't played, um, whatchamacallit, it? Gates to Infinity in a very long time since you know, it first came out. Which was like, I think in the UK it was like May 2013 or May 2012. I think it might have been 2012 actually. I haven't played in a very long time, but I don't remember it ever being that hard. Like, I remember it being quite easy. But this game though, this game is really hard. Like, some of the, uh, the dungeons just seem too difficult. Hey, level 23, nice. I don't want to say it's because I'm under leveled, because I've done all the low dungeon, like low difficulty dungeons for the uh, connection orb, and <laughs> all the, high, the higher ones I can't do because it's so difficult. Well, I guess it's kind of this is uh, you need to like kind of figure out the right way to go and avoid when to run away from enemies, and I guess you need to make use of your items, which I don't really do. I guess we can make the uh, a little bit more easy. Let's just go for a. Can't go for an alliance attack, can I? Ah, try to take this out actually with a bite. There we go. Got more items I can actually set. The looplet as well. I need to make more use of the looplet. Helps increase accuracy. Hell yeah. And we set some to Pikachu. So looplet does help out quite a bit. Quite a damn bit. I need to get some better looplets though. I lost like some really good ones. 
One more before this guy gets me. Oh god, we're getting surrounded. Can't aim that way, there we go. Oh wow. Did not think you could reach Pikachu from that angle. Okay, let's just um Do I not have anything that can save me right now? Am I poisoned as well or did he not poison me? I don't know. He didn't poison me, which is good. Ah, uh, I, I should use a wand to get him away. Take that! And now we can... Maybe take him out. Hey, get back here! There we go. Can't set that on. Okay, uh, we will... Let's go to the next floor, don't want Sparky down by the poison. What that steel I see a Steelix. Oh, I should maybe stay away from this sleep. It's asleep, okay. We good, we good. Time to revive our oh, ban what the hell's a ban seed? Prevents everyone from using last move. Wait, prevents everyone from using your last move. Okay. My last move or their last move? <laughs> oh, I don't know. I do do know that I want to stay away from that Steelix. Oh god. Oh, flame burst! Flame burst! Ha! Okay, let's take a left. I like this, um, whatever I've got on right now that lets me see all the enemies on the screen. Alright, let's let him get closer to me. Ooh, critical hit. Nice. I'm going to walk closer to me so I can go for a nice alliance attack, but oh well. Critical hit again! Oh, 92 damage. Damn, dude. Oh, no! What? Okay, I'm about to get surrounded here, so I'm going to go... Oh, I don't think they can save me here. Don't want that. Let me get into like a better position. To take this guy out. Damn. Should get close to that stupid electrode. Okay, still charging. Bit scared, but hopefully this will finish him off. Love it when I miss. Love it when I miss. So I think the main thing that adds this difficulty of this game is when you miss attacks and stuff. It's just like... Oh. Alrighty, so we are revived. Got an escape orb for that, sweet. Okay. Now I know to stay away from electrodes once they go for a couple of charges because they will destroy me. There's one Steelix on the map, and I think he looks like he might be asleep. Yes, he is. Well, he... Oh, I woke him up! I woke him up! Okay, okay. That's fine. I can take out Steelix. Ha! Yeah, he looks pretty easy. Just gonna try and get past this guy. He's following me. This is not good. Oh, okay, he's not following me. Good. I think with this, uh... Little ability I got right now, seeing enemies on the radar. I should try and stay away from them, and then yeah, that that went well. And there's two big enemies, probably two Stilixes right next to me. Yep. Let's try and stay away from enemies, he says, and then spawns next to a next to an Onyx, a Stilix, sorry, Stilix. Take more flame bursts. Okay. To be fair, they're not that hard to beat. They're kind of easy. Oh god, I'm about to run into one. That's fine. Kinda of like fine these to be honest. Just wanna run out of flame bursts of these screw, but I think I have plenty of elixirs, so again, should be fine. B5! 
Okay, the sleeping Clado. Claydols, though, I'm, I don't know if they're going to be strong or not, so I'll stay away from them. These guys are pretty easy to beat. Like that, there we go. Electro's though, okay, we need to... Okay. Need to make sure uh take you out fast before you even begin to go for that charge. Light screen, okay, let's go for bites. Paralysis, sweet. Let's open for that. Not. Oh, it's gonna go well. Okay, we good. No more enemies on the screen right now, I don't think. Unless it did something to my loop layer, which I said it did, or I don't know what it actually did. That stupid trap. Please be a reviver seed. Oh, look at all these items in this area. Blasty, that's fine. There's one. Want to come closer? That's fine by me. You're so big, I can hit you miles away. Oh, the uh, stairs are in this place. Iron defense, that's fine. Take a critical hit. Blast seed. Okay, I do not mind blast seeds at all. B7F. Oh, Emma Rapport. Okay, uh, I should maybe use that. Okay, and then. Reduces damage from moves. Okay, let's just take that. You know, I think I lost the camera there. It gives me people's location, which kind of sucks. Pikachu, sure you should definitely follow me, buddy. Oh, I think Big Ears is the one I want. The Manetric picked it up, so if I see Manetric, I need to kill him to get it. So I want it. Okay, that's fine. Let's quit using Elixir. I only got one at least. That's fine. Let's go this way. Damn it, Sanji. <laughs> Oh my god. Too much damage. There's my metric, okay. Uh, flame burst. Come closer, my friend. Take this nice Eliza attack. This is the one I want. Yes. Big ears. Replace. Wand expert. And I can see where the enemies are. Sweet. We good now. If I had to run into an enemy though, another minute, check this go down. I need some food. There's the stairs. Got nice. What does grimy food do? I like grimer. Oh. Fills your belly, but bad things will happen. Yeah, let's not eat that. Definitely not. Is this a cave? All of a sudden, it's so dark that I can hardly see anything. What's that sound? Is that the expedition gadget? Anyone, can you hear me? That's Dene, isn't it? We hear you. Sparky, is that you, Sparky? Yeah, Hayden is here too. And Hayden? Where are you, Dene? I think I'm pretty close. Keep going straight ahead. Got it. Oh, this is getting interesting. About to meet up with uh, everyone else. Oh. The Dene and Marwile. So glad you both are safe. If you're here, that means... Yep, they got turned into stone. What? How? We were also turned into stone at the prehistoric ruins. What? We were suddenly attacked by the Pokemon that were at the ruins. They started flashing their lights on their fingers and black shadows came after us. In a flash, we were all turned into stone. Hayden, do you think it could be... Probably was the Behem. I have no idea why though. Those Behem had the power to... The power to turn Pokemon to stone? But do you know why we were turned into stone? 
This place is known as the Voidlands. Seems to be the place where Pokemon are sent when they when they've been turned into stone. Pokemon that have been turned into stone? It's written on the wall here. Right, there is an ancient foot-shaped writing. These are the void lands. The spirits of Pokemon that have been turned into stone are locked away here. It really does say that. It says it right there. Can you read that? The ancient writing? Yep. Don't know how come I don't know how come I can read it though. But I can. That's quite surprising. It took me some time to decipher it. Even with my training, but you just read it so easily. Enemy Pokemon in the Void Lands are not real Pokemon. They are all apparitions made up of hate and given a physical form. We must continue onward to defeat them. I see. So the enemy Pokemon here are all phantoms. But why is that written here anyhow? It must be from long ago. It seems there were past Pokemon that were turned into stone, just like we've been. They've left this record here. Anyway, this is where Pokemon that are turned into stone are sent. So I think the others from the Expedition Society must be here somewhere too. That's why I've been sending out signals non-stop, trying to contact everybody. Seems like I can't reach very far in this world for whatever reason. It's only because we were uh, close to each other that we were able to meet up. I see. That's why you knew we were close a minute ago. Ugh. Sparky? What's wrong? This place is so frightening. I, I felt totally hopeless and was about to give up. We found you two, did Dene and Marwile. I'm glad Hayden kept going and never gave up. Sparky. What do you think uh, those po ancient Pokemon left behind those writings? They did it for Pokemon that have been turned into stone just like they had been. I think they probably felt left hints all over the place in hopes someone would find them. If that's the case, then why do they want us to find them? I believe it's because there must be some way out of this place. W well then, there's still hope. Okay then, yeah I guess there is. There is still hope. Hate them. I was being a scaredy deal caddy. Aw, oh, poor deal caddies. Saying all kinds of pathetic junk. Sorry for causing you trouble, but I'm alright now. Let's go, everybody. We've got to go further and further. We'll find the others from the Expedition Society and get out of this place with everybody. All of us together. Sounds good. So, uh, let's, I guess, deposit some stuff just in case. And uh, we'll draw some items. I don't really see anything I can really worth taking, to be honest. Let's just roll. I'll go the other way. Let's go! Probably to, like, floor, whatever. Oh, okay. Uh, member selection. So we can have... Marwile to Dene. Oh, I wonder who to take. Marwile. <laughs> uh, give an item... Wait, wait, that's mine? That was the one I had for Pikachu. This one. You can have... <laughs> Heavy box. I don't really care for that. <laughs> Let's go. Cave of the Deep. Alrighty then. Got a lick of tongue just looking at me. Oh, he wants to lick me bad. How that miss? It looked like it was perfectly lined up, but oh well. On the orange berry just over there, went bad. Liking the music. Oh, making up behind. Okay, Pikachu's got that easy. There you go. Oh, Hypno. I'll do. And the stairs. I want to assume that's probably like six to eight floors. I don't know, around that. Nice! The Dene's got a pretty good move. Let's uh, set this, whatever it is. Paralysis Guard, that sounds pretty decent. Would've came in handy last area when I was attacking them electrodes, getting paralyzed, but okay, it's fine. The 
Then he's pretty good with that attack and the HP back. Maybe I should have used him on my team instead of Martwile. Either way, he's with us now, so it doesn't really matter. A ditto? Oh god! Uh. Thank you for attacking the right. Oh! Don't attack me. Thank you, Marwile. You know, you're confused, you still managed to, uh. Still my HP, it's all good. I thought I was gonna die then. Can't die, because if I die, I have to get rescued again. Oh, come on. Confusion is just as bad. Oh, I didn't even mean to go up there. That was. Ah, I pressed right and it just walked up instead. First floor. Okay, we're gonna get through this cave. Oh, need that elixir. Friends to hold from getting poisoned or badly poisoned. Okay, yeah, I'll take that. Got some more I can set. Poison guard, let's set that on to Pikachu. Is that one more? No. Stupid dittos! Ah, oh, dittos suck! Got a Pikachu? Nice. Oh god, I got Porygon. No! God damn it! Please kill it! Ah! Flinch it! Oh, I died. Nice. I think for that. Uh, okay, we're good now. We're good. I actually don't mind using this. I'm hoping there's a boss at the end I can have a reason for collecting all these loop um, stones for the looplet. Get that, quick orb. Makes moves work on types that moves a wiki against. Sick. Uh, oh, I'll take that. Next floor. Oh. Let's just take this guy out straight away. That's a big attack. Super critical. Take that as well. Ouch. Not today, Porygon. Good that more while. Yeah, you got that. You missed. Sweet. Ha. Huh. Oh, please be a reviver. Blast seed. Damn it. Want some reviver seeds? <gasps> Clairvoyance. That's why that does like something good. Oh, yeah, items, that's the one. Definitely want that. Nope, you can go away, Porygon. Don't like you. Oh, Looplet. Oh, damn it, Ditto! Not the time to be dittoing. I hate ditto so much. Reviver seed, reviver seed. Bad seed, damn it. I need some tiny reviver seeds so bad to revive orbs. Especially when you're like on higher floors, because if you die, I have to rescue myself and go through these five floors again. It's not nice. It really isn't. Ha! Huh. Paralyzed guard, I ain't getting paralyzed today. Stupid lick of tongue. Ooh. No, more while! Oh, crap. Okay, let's... Thank you for the HP boost, need that 
Oh, come on, seriously? I can't get him. Pikachu's about to get flanked in a second, so land the attacks. Thank you. Oh, thank god they missed, because that would have killed me. Oh, near enough. Oh, stop missing! Okay, we're good, we're good. On any big ears, that, uh, stu- Oh, behem. Stupid, um, oh, that's not, that's not behem, that's... Elgium, pre-evolution. Need a big ears looplet thing to see the enemies so I can try and avoid them if possible. I'm using elixir now, though. I have no elixir, I thought I had one. Let's go, that's gonna get annoying. Oh, supersonic. He's got annoying moves. Ouch, come on. Doesn't help if you don't do more damage. <gasps> My looplet, you stupid lick a tongue. Go away! Confusion, you can stop now. Ah, oh, Pikachu man. Need you to actually. I'm gonna end up dying here, because I can't. It's never a stupid. I don't have an elixir. Just there, damn it. Screw it, blast it. I need to land this. Come on. Yes, oh, thank you. That was so close. I'm still confused. Oh my god, he's. Okay, got my stupid thing. Give me. Are we good. Got some petrified ones that will come in handy. Some items here as well. Oh, ditto! God damn, you are annoying! Can't really do anything, can I? Let's keep going until we get to the end. Oh, d look at that! Just spawn next to a stupid buffalo and a sneasel. That Pikachu might die in a second if I can't. Okay, I like how that sneasel keeps missing. There's a nice elixir there as well. Okay, we good, we good. I think we've got anything to uh, find the stairs straight away. Yes, I do. So usually like the eighth floor, this is just like the midway point. So I'm hoping to do it again. Find the uh, floor and it'll be good. That's annoying. It's up to me now. It's up to me to do this. No time for money. Whew! Looks like it was the halfway point. Oh! There are ancient writings over there too. Be faster to have Sparky read it. Could you? Sure. Here we go. Let's see. Why do Pokemon become stone? Dark matter is the source of all woe. Dark matter? There's more. Dark matter absorbs the energy of Pokemon as it turns them to stone. With that energy, it grows stronger. Dark matter will continue to turn Pokemon to stone to enlarge itself. What does it mean? If what's written here is correct, 
then this dark window is responsible for all the turn to stone incidents. But it was Nuzleaf and the Veltal that was turned us to stone. So what is it? Dark matter? Is it a Pokemon? I don't know. It's the first I've heard of it too. There's something written over there too. Look out for void shadows. Void shadows will make Pokey cuts off right there. Looks like whoever wrote that was in a big rush. Maybe something happened to them as they were writing. Wonder what a void shadows. Well, it does say to look out for them. Dark matter, void shadows. I no longer have any clue what's going on. Got a really bad feeling about this. It's not all bad, huh? Yeah. Yep. Right. Right nearby. What a relief. Could that be? Yep. That sounds right. That way. Hey, Weasel. It's really you, Weasel. Hey, Jackpot. The gang's all here. Mowile did, didn't he? And Sparky and Hayden too. Archin, Bunnelby. So glad you're all safe. Gang's all here. We all set. So I'm starting to think maybe I was right about Eveltal getting like some power from someone. But I see. So it's like that, huh? This place is for Pokemon that would turn us to stone. So that means the Dene said she was uh, glad we're safe. We actually aren't, even though we seem to be. I was beginning to suspect something was up. Even still. I'm happy that we all found each other here. Gives me hope. Guess you're right. Now our Crocodile Pursuit Squad and Prehistoric Ruins Expedition Squad are one. Let's work together and get moving. We're all out, out here together. Keep hope alive and don't give up. Let's do this. Oh, I guess it's a Void Shadow. This is looking pretty good. No, I don't want to rest before I play more. Chapter 18, Hope. If this is the squad going through uh, the next area, oh, so easy. Seems like there should be more Mystery Dungeon over there. It's just this one path. We have no way to go but further. Let's keep going. Sweet. Let's just uh, deposit the money. Yeah, can we even draw anything? Gotta draw the elixirs. Want one of these decoy seed. Yeah, we good. Let's go further. Right, should really keep Sparky, but... Or should I keep Sparky? Mawa's has been pretty good. Can't help but get the feeling that... Uh, we won't have the whole squad of us, it'll be like probably us three and maybe to Dene again, or maybe us three, just us three. Oh no, we've got the whole squad, oh nice! Eat this. I feel like I'm gonna be a boss into this area. Hope so, because I said that like the past two areas. Ha! Not today, buddy. Not today. Going with all these uh, Pokemon here is actually pretty awesome, not gonna lie, I like, quite, quite like it. Oh, my Tang. Ouch! Oh god, I'm confused! Help me! Team! God damn it, team! That was close. If I die, this expedition's all over. Oh, of course, there's a uh, trap right next to the stairs. My luck, just my luck. Calm, craggy area. <laughs> What point was the left? Just like a Sigilyph? Yeah. Oh, confused again. God damn. Come on, Tina's like seven of us. 
Oh god. Uh oh. No. I'm still. What the? What? I had no chance at all for that. I literally was confused and then he just killed me in one hit. Like I said, in a second floor, I'm gonna go rescue myself then. Oh god, I'll see you in a sec. Uh, it's not been. It's not been good. We can get absolutely smashed. Need to meet up with some people. There we go. We should be all right for a little bit now. Got the whole team with me, kind of. Next floor. Oh my goodness. Literally, I walked one step, got one shot again. But now it's all good. Back with the team. Hopefully, don't get teleported across the uh, the dungeon again. Because that was bad. That was awful. All right. Let's continue on, shall we? Let's just go for a nice flame burst. Pow! No, flame burst. Pow! And he's gonna live. Luckily, that does 123 damage. Damn, Weasel. Damn, dude. Going in. Uh, okay, stairs are up here. Get some money. Venipedes. Oh, oh Wallapedes. Sorry, Wallapedes. Wallapedes are scary. There we go. Next floor. I want to assume there's gonna be like 10 or 12 floors because there's like 7 of us, so. That would suck if there is. Get that 30 damage. And I want to get this quick. Uh, okay, let's just go... Equip that, need to equip some stuff on. Oh, I'm confused. They love confusing me, they really do. Oh, that went bad. I need to move. Let me out, Bottle B. Go on, Bottle B. Finish it off. We good? Okay, I'm good. The enemies love confusing me here, don't they? Let's get the stairs. And we through. Ooh. Just like the halfway point. Let's keep going. No reason to stop right now. That's probably a bit too late to get that. Damn it, Weasel just chilling there. Should've... Oh, this looks bad. Oh, that's three enemies? Damn. Oh, Pikachu's kind of. Pikachu's dead. I'm sorry, Pikachu. I <laughs> think Oh, God, it's all my fault. Oh, Pikachu's kind of holding up pretty well right now. Go on, Pikachu. He's going in? Right, Pikachu, I got your back. Probably not. No hit Lee, there you go. Alright, let's hopefully finish this off. Damn it. Whew. Hey, who grew a level, Pikachu? 21. Wants to learn faint. Nah, you got a good move set as it is. Set that there. Oh, I'm not gonna get it, damn it. These are stairs are here though. Oh, there's some decent stuff around here. I wanna get that uh arm berry. God, hell yeah, I'm putting that on. I'm tired of going to sleep all the time. Let's gonna eat this now. Some more HP. I'll let someone deal with that. I don't wanna. Oh, the dog dust talk somewhere. Okay, we good. Everyone split up, and there is the uh, stairs. Nice one more while. Oh, this could be bad. This could be bad. Help me. Someone. Anyone. 
There you go. Oh my god, okay, I'm gonna step back a little bit to um stand with him. Okay, let's go down the stairs all the way over there. Oh, Pikachu. Okay, we all good, we all good. Let's get the items here, hopefully they're good. Trap proof, yes! What is this? Please be like Petrify Orb. Seed Trap Orb. I must use that, I don't care. Well, that's gonna affect me anymore, I'm all good. Whoa, all of a sudden it's pitch black in here. I can't see anything. Is everybody alright? I'm okay. Me too. I can see a light. Let's go check it out. Looks like we've made it. Look at that wall, everybody. Are those ancient writings? Oh god, the void! They're spying on us. They certainly are. I read it. Let's see. Somewhere in this world, there exists a tree of life. That tree of life has become possessed by dark matter. As it grows, dark matter snatches away the vitality of the tree of life. This continues, the tree of life will wither and die. We must do something. That's the end of it. What is this about a tree of life? It's an extremely large tree somewhere in the world and it's called the tree of life. It's a source of vitality that is in the foundation of all living things. It's breathing life into our world at all times. So I want to assume the tree of life is going to be um, Xerneas then, I guess. If a Veltal was like, you know, death and then... Veltal, no sorry, Azonius is life. That makes sense. Indeed it is. May threaten the fate of our planet. So, I've been thinking about it. Do you think that Dark Matter could be here in the Void Lands? Dark Matter here? Yeah. Dark Matter really has possessed that tree? I was thinking maybe the Tree of Life could be here too. I considered that at first myself, but I don't think that's the case. The Tree of Life exists back in our world. The Tree of Life has been possessed by Dark Matter, and that means that Dark Matter is not here in the Void Lands. Oh. Well then, we really have to get back there somehow. I wonder what's going on there now? Hidden did break the barrier over the spring. Can't imagine a Veltar would have just left the luminous water sitting there. Didn't even want to imagine it. But I'm sure it's pretty bad back there. Um, where's Buizel? Oh, yeah, he's gone. What will be two, right? Where could they have gone? Oh god, I bet the void's got him. Oh. Buizel. Oh, there you are. What a relief. You're not as worried. Where'd you run off to, Boozle? Have you seen Bunnelby? Stay back, everybody. That Boozle is an imposter. What? Bunnelby? I seen it. Some creepy looking black creature transformed a Boozle. What? This is not a Boozle. Watch out. Ugh. What was that for, my while? The imposter here is you. Bunnelby would never say seen, he would have said saw. Weasel! Bunnelby! What is that? What's going on here? What happened to Bunnelby? More than likely, it's too late for Bunnelby now. What? Watch out everybody, here they come! Brace yourselves! Oh god, we got some weird, like, black sludge. Okay, uh, flame burst! Ha! Oh god, they split? Oh, I don't know. Damn, Pikachu's going off. That was easy. Thanks to Marwile and Pikachu, I guess, they went off. Just keep coming. We gotta run, man. We gotta run. What are these things? No matter how many times we smack them down, they just pop right back up. It's no use. They won't stop. Are there even more of them now? Oh god, he's eating Boizel! Oh god! Marching! To the nay! Sparky, there's nothing you can do for them now. Save yourself. But, I saw an oath. All together. With everybody. 
I swore that we would all get out of here together. Then this had to happen. It was in a more while. The day? Don't worry about us. Get out of here for our sakes. Oh god. Oh no, I let my guard down. What's going on here? It's all black and sticky. I can't move. You alright? That's Sparky. No, Sparky. Okay, I have to save Hayden. I have. Help. Oh god, I feel like I'm about to faint. I can't. Up. I'm trying, but my senses are all slipping away. It's no use. I guess this is it. That's one powerful growl. Entei! Raikou Suicune! Am I saved? Hayden, are you okay? We have to get away from here. What? What about Dedene and Archin? If we stay here, we will meet the same fate. Give it up! Our story is getting so interesting. We appear to be safe for the time being. You saved us. Thank you. But. What about Dedenne and the others? Whoa! Do you think we came to save you? Do not think so highly of yourselves. We have merely judged you necessary to make our escape from this place. Necessary? The human. Should you hope to overcome this crisis, summon a person. The writings of those ancient Pokemon are related to these turning stone incidents. We believe a human is the key. You can read the ancient writings, can you not? You can also understand them to a point. We will need a precise transla translation. It's also a matter of your uh, scarves. Scarves? On Fire Island, those scarves suddenly began to glow. <laughs> Pikachu's face then. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get the Charizard again. That was awesome. We do not understand why that happened. But those scarves appear to be imbued with a special power. They may be of use to us when the time comes. Can you comprehend that? Unfortunate as it may be, you'll be the pawns we sacrifice to leave this place. What? And if we refuse? Then you'll leave us no choice. I could take him on. You'd have already been defeated by Void Shadows if it were not for us. Your lives are on, on ours now. Do you have no complaints? Man, the, the three beasts are dicks, man. Damn. We've also deciphered some of the ancient writings. And... The mountain that you see there? It's known as Reverse Mountain. The very summit of that mountain is apparently connected to the world from which we came. Our world? We'll make our way there now. Do not attempt to defy us. You will prioritize our escape as you, as you support us. There are no other options for you. Now we go. I don't like them. I don't like where this is going. I want to help the Dene and all the others too. I hate to say this, Sparky, but considering our current situation, that may no longer be possible. What? At least here in the Voidlands, I mean. If we make it back to our world, there is a way to bring them, bring back all those Pokemon. Oh, luminous water, right? Can't imagine Nuzleaf would just leave the Spring of Revelation Mountain be. But we may be able to find luminous water somewhere else. We can just get out, get out of here somehow. I think we'll find some means of saving everyone. All right. I expected nothing less from you, my while. Feel a little bit better now. We share a common goal, so we might as well stick with them. Yeah, we can get out of here too. What are you doing? Come quickly. Let's look for a chance to break through to our world while we follow them. Stupid NT Raikou and Suicune. Oh, I used to like you. Well, I never like trying to capture you on Pokemon games because you always run away. Stupid 
fleet in Pokemon. That appear to be the entrance. You take the lead. But me? I want to see what sorts of enemies we will face. We'll depart as soon as you your preparations are complete. Okay. Go down to me, so I'll just go. If the three dogs well three beasts are with us. We uh we should be alright. Hopefully Oh yes, oh this should be easy. Spirit here, okay. Entei, he's sleeping, leave him alone. Sleep, Entei. Just Spiritoon chilling, not causing any harm. Entei's like, yo, I'm attack you when you're sleeping. Oh, chocolate, nice. Go on, Raikou, you can do the work. Okay, we're good. Oh damn, and a ghastly. Just gonna let the uh, the beast do the work and I'll just uh run by, like just get the free XP I guess. I'm all good with that. Don't do any work. Oh god. Gotta be careful to be honest. Ooh. Either slash. Yep, that's just oh he's gone. That's fine. And there's the stairs. Oh, we lost Suicune and Pikachu. Oh well. <laughs> They'll join us now when we go up. Go on, my beasts. You call me your pawn? Well, in fact, you're my pawn. You're gonna get me through this uh, mountain. I'm just gonna chill in the back. Need all the work, it's all good. You guys, take out the Age Slash. I'll just uh, go and pick up my orbs. Until you got that. Good boy. Now let's go down this way. I'll pick that up just in case. Never know what kind of one that's gonna be. I think Pikachu might die. Oh Pikachu, oh you're dead. I'm sorry, Pikachu, I fought you. Come on. Oh no, okay, it's fine. I mean, as long as I keep the three dogs with me, I'll be completely fine. Uh, let's go this way. Aspera Tomb! Hey, 24, sweet. Still doesn't want another move. Could really go for like a new fire type move. Oh, okay. No, I'm asleep. Go on, everyone. Spread out. Save me. Save your lead. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I hate being asleep. I can't do anything. I'm confused as well. I'm dead. Oh, my God. That sucks. Like, I couldn't do anything. I didn't want to walk that way. Okay. I am revived, and Pikachu's back here as well, so that's pretty good. Whew. Okay. Stupid confusion, sleep, and everything together just sucks so much. Damn, Entei. Entei went my new big bodyguard right now, just wrecking everyone in the way. Ooh, go on, Entei. Take out the Ghastly as well. No, I, I won't go just yet, Entei. I'll let you take out the Ghastly just to you know, show him who's boss. There you go. That's what the Ghastly gets for putting me to sleep. And I've got Suicune, so I'm gonna keep pushing Suicune across the left where he takes everyone out. I need to uh, start equipping myself with, damn it, some these bad boys. Just, yep, nope. Enter, you go first. I'm push these guys along now, hopefully. There you go. Ah, stairs are here, sweet. What's this, this is super critical, I'll take that, thank you. Sick floor. Get a nice elixir. Oh, if that's the um, oops, a little tiny reviver seed. I'll be so happy. There's also an orum berry that I want to grab. Blast seed. Ah. Eat this. Ah, 
Yeah, I can do, I can do 100 damage myself. Or 800, I guess. Swap this for uh, some grimy food. I'm gonna eat this. Dude! Goes for me! I didn't do anything! Stupid Sork, I hate you! We've climbed quite far. Look! There! Ancient writing. You! But me? Read. <laughs> oh, okay, here I go. At last you have made it here. Just beyond here, at the top of a reverse mountain, is the door to hope. Path of light that connects to the world you once knew. It's an exit from these void lands. So it is at the summit. However, there is a problem. A countless number of void shadows are blocking the light from above the ground. And what? One of those black thingies? And they're countless now? Fine, keep reading. Um, the power to defeat these shadows is unfortunately not something I possess, and so I will wait here. What is this about waiting? For what? Judging by the position of the stars, dark matter should stop momentarily. Dark matter is related to the movements of the astro astronomical bodies. If everyone fighting back against the dark matter in this world can somehow protect the tree of life, dark matter will cease, and the end of the world will be averted, and I will be able to leave this place. In other words, I will be able to return from being stone. However, even if I were to get out of here, the fight would not end there. I must prepare for the distant future. That's the end of it. A stopped dark matter? The position of the stars? What does it all mean? Dark matter is snatching away vitality from the tree of life. The tree of life is wilting in our planet. No, our world will soon come to an end. But dark matter has some relationship with the position of the stars. I believe it has sometimes become active. Other times it stops. The Pokemon who wrote this must have known uh, that it was about to stop. That's why I decided to wait here for it to do that. I wonder if they got out of here alright. Don't know about that, but it seems there's a little, little doubt that Dark Matter ceased once long ago. How do you know that? Because our world still exists. If Dark Matter hasn't stopped, this planet would have been finished. None of us would have even been born. The last thing written here? I must prepare for the distant future. In the distant future mentioned there is our era. It's right now. The ancient Pokemon who wrote this wasn't just concerned for their own time. They knew that in the distant future, Dark Matter would return. And as expected, Dark Matter has returned in our time. Those ancient Pokemon who protected the Tree of Life, they made preparations to protect us here in our time as well. One of the measures they took must have been to seal the sealed spring that was on Revelation Mountain. But you were outwitted by the likes of Nuzleaf and even if a Veltal. It's all thanks to your foolishness. Hey! Hey! I guess I know what would happen if I just said what I wanted to say. I'll just growl at us angrily again, so I won't say it. What's up with that? Who's he calling foolish? He's so rude. Based on the position of the stars, do you think Dark Matter will cease in our time? Are you hoping that if we just wait here, we're able to get out? I think you better give up on that hope. These incidents of Pokemon being turned to stone started happening not that long ago. We haven't precisely determined when Dark Matter became active again, but at the very least, we can expect its activity to continue for some time. <laughs> I was not hoping for anything. I was only asking out of curiosity. We will root the uh, enemy with our power. Onward to our escape. You take the lead again. When you prepared yourself, we will make for the summit. Till we can leave this world, you are nothing more than tools to us. Ha! <laughs> tools. And actually, you're my tool. Jeez, what's with the attitude? I mean, this is a global crisis and they're only worried about themselves? Doesn't it make you mad, Marwile? You're as strong as Entei, right? All the same, our power is no match for the tree of the legendary Pokemon. And also, how can I put this? For whatever reason, it just doesn't bother me. It's kind of strange, I guess. <laughs> is that how it is? Oh well. Anyhow, I think we're almost there. Let's do our best to make our escape with Entei and the others. Sounds good, let's go. Don't need any preparations when I've got the trio with me, because they do all the work and I just, uh, I just tag along. Oh, okay, uh. How do you? Go walk left and right, let them do all the work. Let's just take this. and we go. Ooh, look at all the stuff for me. Damn, Raikou, that was... Pretty good. Oh, just 
Just swap this for some more grimy food. There we go. Pikachu, why would you attack? He was just sleeping, Pikachu. There was no reason. There was no reason. Oh my god, I guess we can... Terraform's probably gonna end up... Oh no, okay, we're good. Terraform was just sleeping there, Pikachu's like, yo, I'm gonna attack you. Uh-oh. Nope! Nope, oh, run away. Go on, Raku, you get ahead of me. Now do. Uh-oh. Huh. There you go. Push, push him forward a little bit. Go on, sweet king. Go ahead. Gasly. was defeated, that's fun. Okay, got time to get these items, hopefully they take them out before. Um oh, dude, what's this? What's we keep standing on gold bar? Oh my god, traps, traps suck. Alright. Go on, MK. Go on, Suicune. Finish him off. And the Aegis Slash as well. I see it over there. Heal up, I'm, I wasn't gonna die. Um, don't know how I'm gonna get HP back, to be honest. It's an amount of time before I die. Sandstorm would just go to be honest. Oh crap. Just gonna keep pushing Raikou into trouble. Serious, there's a trap. I should have known. Okay, so we are back. So basically, what happened is I tried rescuing myself and I had to go from floor one, got to floor seven, and I uh, didn't get to floor eight at all. But I got there about three, four times and I kept dying because the sandstorm um, killed off Salamons or I just couldn't make it because it was so goddamn difficult. But luckily, when I had to lose all my items to come back and do this, I started from floor 7, so that's pretty good. So I floor 8 again. Unfortunately, I've lost all my items, so I have no loot player, no apples, no nothing. So we're just going to make our way through here. Hopefully, get some items on the way. Just going to make sure I uh, kind of just run away from these guys. But man, this game is so difficult. It really is. Like, oh, trying to use Keldeo, Salamence, and um, Gudra, who are all level 50. Well, Keldeo is like 42. But Salamence and Gudra are 50, and I just could not get through here. The Pokemon were way too strong. Like, there you go, Pikachu's dead. The, uh, the Trevenants, the Aegislash, everything was just an absolute nightmare to get through. It really was. 
Like, I, I love this game's story, I really do. But the dungeons, this place, oh my god, dude, I could play some footage what happened. At, right. So I had Salamence left, I was on the floor 7 or 6, and a Ghastly got me trapped and looped into a, um, like, a, oh god, he went mean look, he went, uh, oh god, now it's a Haunter. No, I'm going to attack him. Okay, he went, uh, mean look, lick, confuse ray hypnosis, and he just got me lo looped in for, like, from full health to, to kill me. It was absolutely ridiculous, and I... I got so angry, man. I got so I was like, this is absolutely ridiculous. This should not be happening. The game was so broken. It was it was just so bad. Sorry, Rick, I could have revived you, but I mean, I assume there's only like 12 floors. We've got Ente, we've got Suicune. Just gonna send them up first against this Bronzong. There we go. It's just the belly and the sandstorm, like I'm gonna end up dying. Actually, quite difficult. Believe it or not, but this game is super stressful and super hard. My wife's gonna die. Oh yeah, he managed to survive. Nice. I am not fine, I ghastly. There we go. Hopefully, the next floor has um stupid. Oh god. Stupid no sandstorms, I can... We didn't like... Uh, how do I switch? I don't think I can. Must be able to, because I did it with uh, the rescue team. I was just pressing them buttons, but it was switching, but now I won't do it. Oh my, so we can faint it. Damn, enemies on this floor are so difficult. Must be over here then. Come on, stairs, where are you? I need you bad. Where are the stairs? There, damn. Oh, thank god I made it. We have reached the top. The ancient writings were indeed to be trusted then. This should be the so-called door to hope. I see no door. This is the highest point that we could reach, have reached so far. That is a certain at least. The sky is not far above us now. But that blackness covers it now. That black mass. Uh oh. So as I expected. So these are the countless shadows we read of. And more just come I guess. What is that? It's already gone. For that one second. It certainly looked like it could be the door to hope, alright? That's it. So the door to hope is that lone beam of light that connects to our world. The light is hidden beneath the many shadows now gathered in this place. Then, if we can just manage to beat all these shadow things, the light will shine. The door to hope will appear before us. And we got Mega Gengars. And a Mega Tyrannosaur. Oh, now what? Stand firm. They are no more than illusions, drawn forth by the countless shadows we face. Disperse, foul shadows. We will reach the door to hope. Onward! So we've got to fight two Mega Gengars. The... Alright, second time's a charm. It's actually pretty difficult this is. So, let me go down here. Got to be careful with the uh, Mega Gengars because they have Shadow Tag and you can't run away. That was my biggest problem last time. So now that we're kind of all bunched together, Raikou's kind of off by himself, but yeah, Raikou can kind of die. Take out the Mega Gengars first. You know, Suicune and Entei want to attack the other things instead. Let 
It feels really laggy around here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it feels really freemy. Oh, sweet coon. Careful what you're aiming that bubble beam, man. Can I get a turn now? There we go. Let's do as much damage as we can right now to this Mega Gengar. Pow, pow, pow. Not that much. That's one of the voids gone. Sweet. Ouch. Still alive. Still alive, though. Entei fainted. Okay, I can revive Entei, though, at least. I've got some tiny reviver seeds. Take out the Mega Gengars next, and we should be fine. Okay, there's one down. Okay. So far, so good. It's got a... Uh, that'll be fine actually, I've got plenty of items now. No, Suicune, what are you doing? Bad Suicune. Raccoon needs to get over here. Okay, I need Suicune, Suicune will help out tremendously. Uh, don't want to use that because we want to revive Suicune instead. Yes. There we go. How many left? How many uh, res uh, seeds do I have left? Because that sandstorm's probably going to kill me. I have two. Uh, I have three actually, I think. Either way, turn to revive a seed, get the Entei. I'm going to die in a second, which is fine. Hey, I finished off. Nice, didn't even have to revive him. Ha! That was a good battle, kind of. We finally beat them all. The door to hope. Must pass through it. Run! What in the. Riker is not happy about that. The, do the door to hope is gone. No matter how many of them we beat, just keep coming. Now they're behind us too. There's no end to them. We can do like this, we'll run out of strength before they run out of mem uh, numbers. My while. Must beg a favour. Aiden, are you okay? Try, but I just can't. Why does the door to hope keep on disappearing so quickly? I don't want to just give up. At this rate, don't know how we can... What? Can I trust you to do this thing or not? So that was your plan all along? Fine, I will do it. Raikou, Suicune, I am ready. After all, we decided this together. Ah, uh, I guess they're probably going to sacrifice themselves for us to get out. Hope you're ready. What are you... Now is the time. Marwal sacrificed himself. This is... Sparky Hayden, go through the door! You want us to what? We knew it might come to this, we were prepared. We're not such fools as to believe that we would all make it back from this place. But, but... Wait, just go for the door, it's going to close. You're the ones. You're the best chance of uh, saving our world. Since I found Suikun and Raikun here in the Void Lands, we exchange a vow. 
We vow that we will deliver the two of you back to our former world. You two are our hope. You guys. Okay, I like the trio again. Door to hope fades. Go now, you fools. Hate them. Everyone, just hold on a little while. We are definitely coming back for you. We will save you all from this place. I swear it. Sparky Hayden, we leave this planet in your hands now. Save our world. Hot oh, dang, this game is starting to heat up. Well, I'm going to end this part right here. Being a very long episode, I have been recording, uh, believe it or not, for uh, two and a half hours. I mean, them rescue missions were not very easy. They were quite long. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time where we are probably going to be on the hunt for Mr. Nuzleaf and stuff. So I'm going to save and return to main menu. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you then. Have a great day. Peace.